Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. So in this video, we're gonna show you the top five handheld scan tools for Volvo vehicles in 2024 and 2025. We'll show you the cheapest through to the most expensive and explain what kind of features and functions each of these tools will offer. We'll put links to all of these kits in the description and in the pinned comment. It is very important though to understand that there are fakes, there are clones on the market and they can damage your vehicle. So if you're using the links in the description below, they will ensure sure that you go through to the genuine and official products okay and at the end of the video what I'll do is I'll show you which of these tools I would personally recommend if it was my personal money on my personal Volvo given what I know about these tools and what I've learned about using these tools uh, over the past year or so okay um, if, if by the end of the video you're still unsure about which tool to go for, then please do use the email address in the description below. Send us an email, send us your vehicle information, and we can recommend something based on what it is you're looking to get out of the tool, okay? Uh, also, at the end of the video, I'm gonna show you a uh, really, really high-end diagnostic tool that goes over and above everything that we've got on the table, but we'll come to that when we need to, okay? So first of all, we're looking at the VOL version 1.0. That's V-O-L 1.0. This tool is the most basic tool on the table. It's the cheapest as well, but it does offer good system coverage. So if, say for example, you've got like a check engine light, an ABS light, an airbag light, transmission, uh, or you've got a fault with like your power steering, your central locking, your HVAC systems, then this tool will allow you to diagnose those faults and reset any associated warning lights. It'll give you a unique fault code, it'll give you a description of the fault as well, okay? Um, so this is a really good tool if you're really only interested in sort of looking at a fault that you have now, and maybe you're not worried, too worried about faults that it might get in the, in the future. Um, this does come with one service function as well, okay? You'll hear me talking about service functions quite a bit in this video but service functions we're looking at the, for this tool would be just the oil service reset so when you get the oil service or the maintenance required message on screen this tool will allow you to do the reset for that message as well okay so that's the version one we then move on to the vol version 2.0 tool this will do everything that this tool will do it's a little bit more expensive um, but it has additional features and functions. Okay, so the when it comes to code reading and things like that, um, it does a little bit newer vehicles and also the service functionality is a lot better. So this one will only do oil service reset for the service functions. This will do DPF regeneration, electronic parking brake, electronic throttle calibration, steering angle sensor calibration, new battery registration, injector coding, and brake bleeding, okay? It is very important though for me to point out that it doesn't do those functions on all vehicles. So if you wanted to double check which of those functions would work on your vehicle, please do use the email in the description below. We will be able to check to make sure that it does do what it says for your specific vehicle, okay? So that's the iCarsoft version 2.0 tool. On some occasions, there are situations whereby this tool won't be able to say carry out a DPF regeneration on a certain vehicle. That's where the version 3.0 tool comes in. This is the Vol version 3.0. This has better hardware, so it has better software as well, and therefore it allows much greater coverage for not only the vehicles, the, the newer vehicles, but also the service functionality as well, okay? So it does a lot more service functions than this one on a lot more vehicles uh, for just a little bit more, not a great deal more, I'll be honest with you, but it also does, uh, over and above these tools, it does actuation tests, it does sus suspension calibration, transmission adaption, uh, air conditioning reset, engine adaption, and other adaptions as well. So it's a bi-directional scan tool, which means you can do component testing, which is a really, really good feature to have. So that's the version 3.0 tool. We then move over to the iCarsoft CR Pro Kit, which has been a really popular tool for a number of years. That is because it gives such a wide variation of manufacturer coverage. So let's say you have got a Volvo, but you also have a BMW, a Ford, a Land Rover. Um, this tool covers a huge range of vehicles and is definitely worth looking at if you do want to look after more than just your Volvo. Um, when it comes to service functionality, it matches the service functions of the Vol version 2.0. So um, again, it, it just realized this tool has fallen over. 
Um, yeah, so it gives you the same service functionality as this tool here, uh, but obviously it does that for a wide range of vehicles. So it's been a really good option, um, has really good system coverage, vehicle coverage as well, okay? So that's the iCarsoft CR Pro Kit. We then move on to the CR Max Kit. This is hands down the best tool on the table. It's a tablet-based kit. It's a touch screen, it's intuitive, it's fast. It does everything that all of these tools will do. Um, it covers all manufacturers. It matches the service functionality of the version 3.0 tool. So what this tool is, it gives you the best of vehicle coverage. So up to quite modern vehicles, best of um, system coverage. So the maximum amount, amount of systems within the vehicle, the best of the service coverage, uh, the service functions, which we talked about. So it does all of the service functions. And it, it, I think this is probably recommended if maybe you've got like, um, maybe say for example, you're an enthusiast and you've got a few cars or maybe within your family group, your family circle, there's quite a few cars there. And you just maybe want a tool that will look after all of them and look after your future vehicles as well. Um, I think also, you know, maybe if you're a small garage or a small workshop, this would also be beneficial for you uh, because you guys may not necessarily know what you're going to be getting in day to day. So um, it's always good to have a, a tool which can deal with whatever you're going to be getting in. So um, when it comes to updates, free lifetime updates on all of these tools. Um, some other manufacturers like Autel and Xtool, their tools, they'll give you free updates for the first year. And then after that, they'll charge you, depending on what tool it is, maybe like 100 to 150 pounds per year for the updates. Well, the, the beauty of these tools is that they are free updates for life. You'll never have to pay anything else once you've bought the tool, okay? Now, I mentioned at the start of the video that I would give you my recommendation on which tool I would go for if it was my personal money and my personal Volvo. There were two tools I wanna uh, sort of recommend for you. First of all, being the Vol version 3.0 tool. It really does pack a really good punch and it, I would say probably go for this one if you're looking for a tool which just looks after your Volvo. Um, so you're not really bothered about other vehicles, you're only going to be using it on your Volvo, then definitely go for this one because it offers such a high level of coverage, a high level of service functionality as well. Uh, and this has been a really, really good seller for Volvo vehicles. Since this was introduced, sales of these tools have sort of died down because this is so good. It does cost more than these two, only a little bit more than this one. So I'd say for the extra that you pay, you're getting such a high amount of improvement for diagnostics and service functions. Okay, so that's the Volvo version 3.0. If you've got a Volvo and you really want to be looking after other cars as well, you've got another, you've got another vehicle in your, your, your circle, uh, whatever your circle is, then it would definitely be the iCars of the CR Max. Yes, I do understand that it's the most expensive tool on the table. It is more expensive than these tools. But the level of coverage, the level of functionality, the level of um, manufacturer coverage that you get from a tool like this, the ease of use, the easy to navigate all of the menus and whatnot, um, then it would definitely be this one if I had more than a Volvo or just this one if I was interested in my Volvo, okay? Um, what else have we got? We've got the iCars of Seo Ultra that I wanted to show you. The reason I'm just showing you this is because this is a tool that can pretty much do everything that the specialist or the main dealer can do. Um, it's called the iCars of Seo Ultra. It's quite a high-end tool, and because of that, it's quite expensive. It's retailing at about £1,500. But the only reason I wanted to show you that is because there are some guys out there who just want the absolute top-line tool, uh, and money isn't always uh, an issue. So that's the CR Ultra if you do fall into that category. But for most DIYers, the tools on the table will be more than sufficient and enough. If you're still not sure about which tool to go for, then please do use the email address in the description below. Send us your vehicle information. We'll take a look. We'll get back to you as soon as we can, depending on your specific needs and circumstances. And I will put links to all of these kits in the description below this video. Guys, thanks for watching, and I hope this has helped.